हेलो एवरीवन क्लास फोर्थ चैप्टर टू अबाउट इंडिया हेयर वी विल डिस्कस इन दिस चैप्टर अबाउट इंडिया फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल डिस्कस हेयर नेबरिंग कंट्रीज ऑफ इंडिया इंडिया लाइज इन सॉर्दर्न पार्ट ऑफ द कॉन्टिनेंट ऑफ एशिया वेन एवर यू सी द ग्लोब और अ मैप you can see the continent of asia and the southern part where india is located it is seventh largest country in the world and the neighboring countries of india are sri lanka bangladesh bhutan myanmar china nepal afghanistan pakistan and maldives these are neighboring countries of india India and some of its neighboring countries together are known as Indian subcontinent. These are about neighboring countries of India. Now physical features of India. What are the physical features? The land forms and water bodies of India. These are physical features of India. Like the northern mountains the northern plains the great indian desert the plateau region the coastal plains the islands these are physical features of india in the north we have the snow capped peaks of northern mountains they are known as the himalayas we all know we all aware of it these mountains run from north west to the northeast of india like a huge arc they protect us from the extreme cold winds that blow from the central asia the vast flat lands to the south of the himalayas are called the northern plains these plains have rich fertile soil brought down by the rivers ganges or ganga indus brahmaputra and their tributaries we all the aware of that fertility that comes from the himalayas and ganga river now in the western part of india lies the great indian desert it is also known as the desert thar desert this is a hot and dry sandy area very few plants like cactus and date palms grow in the thar desert it is very dry and very hot place where only we found the desert and these kind of plants the southern part of a plateau region is the vast table land known as the deccan plateau on the western and eastern sides of the deccan plateau are called the coastal plains the deccan plateau is bordered by mountain ranges on the eastern and western sides the ranges on the west are called the western ghats and the, on the east they are called eastern ghats these are all belongs to the physical features now we will discuss about political divisions of india new delhi is the capital of india we all aware of it it lies in the national capital territory of delhi our country is governed from the new delhi by the central government which is headed by the prime minister of india india is divided into 29 states and na seven union territories each state has its state government which is headed by the chief minister of the state the national capital territory of delhi is a union territory each union territory is directly governed by the central government and i told you before central government is governed by our prime minister these are the some thing about the political divisions which tells us 
29 states we have and 7 union territories in our country. So there are some our states and their capitals. Andhra Pradesh and its capital is Amravati, Arunachal Pradesh, Eatnagar, Assam, Deepur, Bihar, Patna, Chhattisgarh, Raipur, Goa, Pan and Chhattisgarh, Raipur, Goa, Panaji, Gujarat, Gandhinagar, Himachal Pradesh, Shimla, Haryana, Chandigarh, Jammu and Kashmir, Srinagar, Jharkhand, Ranchi, Karnataka, Bengaluru, Kerala, Tiruvantampuram, Madhya Pradesh, Bhopal, Maharashtra, Mumbai, Manipur, Imphal, Meghalaya, Shillong, Nagaland, Kohima, Mizoram, Ezwal, Odisha, Bhubaneswar, Punjab, Chandigarh, Rajasthan, Jaipur, Sikkim, Gangtok, Tamil Nadu, Chennai, Telangana, Hyderabad, Tripura, Angartala, Uttar Pradesh, Lucknow, Uttarakhand, Dehradun, West Bengal, Kolkata. These are some states and their capitals. And now, Union Territories and their capitals, Andaman and Nicobar Island, Port Blair, Chandigarh, Chandigarh, Dadar and Nagar Haveli, Silvasa, Daman and Diu, Daman, National Territory of National Delhi, Delhi, Lakshdeep, Kavarvati, Punducherry, Puducherry. These all about the our country, India. The physical features and the political feature we can see in it. And now some questions related with it. What are the major physical features of India? How many states and union territories are there in India? Name two states and two union territories and their capital. Name two neighboring countries of India located to the south of India. So, these all about our country, India. Thank you.